Walnut Creek police say downtown is as safe as it ever has been. Still, it's clear thieves are finding comfort in targeting visitors wearing expensive jewelry. I feel like now I should be a little bit more cautious. I think it's really sad because it happens too often here. This after a man was robbed of his wallet and Rolex watch Saturday night after spending time at Bounty Hunter near Broadway Plaza, an area where police have added patrols in recent months to deter retail thefts. Saturday's robbery happened in the back parking lot of the restaurant and the general manager says three suspects were involved. He's made all of his staff aware and is looking into possibly adding lights in the back lot to make patrons feel safer. I love it. It's my second one and uh, it's a great watch. Despite the theft, some Rolex owners still intend to wear their watches worth tens of thousands of dollars in public. I've been coming down here to eat for my whole life. It's pretty safe as far as I'm concerned. Last month, a man in Walnut Creek was robbed of his Rolex at gunpoint on his driveway. Armed robbers also stole a man's Rolex outside Trader Joe's in Danville. These thefts are happening regionally and across the state. San Francisco police say they are investigating more than two dozen high-value watch robberies since the start of the year. Investigators there saying they are likely connected to organized crime. In Walnut Creek, Philippe Jagal, Cron 4 News.